That's Kiwi. Not you, Kiwi. Dark Kiwi, making noises as usual. How are you doing? How is live? You're team backups, right? Yeah, that's not even a question. Like, <laughs> that's, a, that's a stupid question. <clears throat> Obviously, you are team backups. Kiwi, jeez, chill. That's not a question. <laughs> yeah, the moment I said it, I knew it sounded stupid. Yeah, let's play some games, some video games. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Oh, I can't wait to have my own desk. Like, this microphone over here, right over here, you can't even see it. I cannot move it because it's mounted incorrectly, upside down. It's shit. That's one of the reasons that the micro quality of my streams are shit too, because I'm not um, speaking into the microphone. You know, microphones have a very specific entry point. Ah, so crowded, this little closet. I hate it so much. Dragon Gamer, how are you doing? How are you doing? Why is there no audio? There you go. There you go. I hear Splatoon sounds. Oh. Alright, 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 alright. Yeah, I'm Team Bear Cups as well. My, my logic was that they are the closest thing to dogs. Off the three, the way they look, they're just cute. What can I say? How's the weekend, Kiwi? How's the weekend, Dragon? Oh, let me inform Discord. We live. FD1. Let's play a couple of games, shall we? I haven't played too much. To be honest, just a few matches yesterday and a few today. Switch, I'm doing good. Quite lazy weekend for me. The lazy weekends are the better weekends, Kiwi. Oh, <laughs> Kiwi, my dog is looking at me like, what are you talking about? Are you talking to me? You idiot. Um, I didn't... Well, I didn't have a lazy weekend per se, but I was still not feeling too well. So I'm, I'm slowly but steadily recovering fr from whatever I had. Some sort of flu. So I, I kind of slept a lot. 
You're joining my games. Awesome. Yeah, I don't think there are too many Bear Cups chappies tonight. So it might be just it might be just you and me. But it was stormy, it was sober. Played some Hell Divers with Wesley and uh, um, HWP. Some Han Showdown, obviously. Doo -doo -doo. Played some VR stuffs. Walked the dogs a couple of times. Um, brought my son to a birthday party. How was it? Hell Divers. Oh, we like it. We have uh, we've been playing it for like a couple of evenings now. I can check how many hours I spend so far. Let me see. 12 hours so far. Ah, I feel like we've spent more time. No, it's a wonderful game. I'm a, a big fan of um, like those wave kind of um, shooters where you have where you have like waves of enemies in a co-op fashion. I'm just a sucker for that good old classic co-op gameplay um, it's cool I enjoy it I, I, I really like the aliens uh, it really reminds me obviously of Starship Troopers a game that I um, a, a movie that I really liked when I was younger for all the right and wrong reasons uh, because there was so much gore and nudity in it <laughs> like, like I'm not sure why my parents allowed me to see it but uh, yeah that it's just a it's just, it's a good game. Uh, I do have to say I think we are now getting to a point where we have played it all ish. Like I feel like most of the enemy types and mission types, I think we've we've, we've seen it all. I guess, but it's still fun. It's it's t somewhat of a grind, by the way, to get all the weapons unlocked. What a cute music. Um, Kiwi, what, do you prefer a game mode? Like, um, game mode. Let's not, let's not mix up words here. Like, I'm, I'm up for try or the normal one. I don't, I don't mind. Whatever you like. Oh, out of battery. Cool, great. I'm just gonna play, uh, one solo. Solo. I'm a solo. Yeah, then we'll we'll start with try. Give me, give me, hey. He really needs to learn some manners, man. He's just walking on tables like it's a normal thing to do. It's such a grind. Yeah, you you. It's not hard, easy to unlock the weapons you want, you know. And I don't want to spend too much money on the game, like real money, extra money. I think I bought one armor just because, you know, it was fun. But I really enjoyed the game, yeah. Um, like a few months earlier, we bought the Starship Troopers game, and it's kind of similar, but just way worse. <laughs> this game is just better in every single aspect. It's the same uh, kind of uh, vibes. The Starship Troopers is actually a real Starship Troopers game. This one is more like a, a rip-up. Uh, Starship Troopers. Uh, extraction or uh, Starship Troopers uh, something. Extraction? Not sure. But uh, Helldivers is, is inspired by the movie Starship Troopers. The aliens are almost one one on one. The, um, well, the same kind of aliens from uh, this, the movie Starship Troopers. I think they're even called similar. Hi, here. How are you doing? Oh, we're talking about um, Helldivers and Starship Troopers. It's a PC game. How are you doing, Atenia? How's the weekend? How are you? I was, I was live. I'm rocking these the Fluttershop Pro for for a change. Like takes me back to earlier. Really a weapon I always like to play with in... I'm not sure if that's in 2, probably? He's down. Oh, I 
almost had him at the suction bump. How about my dude? There, killed him. Couldn't go anywhere. See, the range is insane. I like it. Whee! We're taking it back! We're taking it back! No! How <laughs> did I miss my shots there? Good lord. I can do that too. Ah, no. Annoy them a bit. I need to get away from here. I did what I could, all right? Um, I'm, I'm, I'm not sure. We have lost, right? No, we didn't. I don't want to get all the props, but... Ah! You don't know this game? The Helldivers is one of the biggest successes of the past few weeks, I think. It's a PC game, so if you're not into the PC world, then you probably don't know it, but... It's like a, a co-op mode where you go with a bunch of friends to a planet to destroy something, and you'll get, like, lots of zombies or terminated kind of robots against you. Um, uh, and it's just dumb fun. <laughs> dumb fun. A, a enemy wave. PvE wave shooter. Uh, you can somewhat, in a weird way, compare it to Salmon Run, <laughs> but then just a way bigger scale and obviously more impressive graphics and, st and stuff. Um, all right, I'm going to start the tricolor for uh, I think Kiwi. If the switch is um, charged. Do -do -do -do. Do, 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 do. You're doing good, Kiwi and Neptunia. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Stardew Valley taking all my time. Oh man, oh this dragon. All right, we can switch spots. I still have to play the game. It's uh, not sure if I will ever will. There are so many games that I want to play, but my weekend has been quite busy. Today's my mother's birthday. Happy birthday to your mother, Neptunia. And she wanted a new pillow cases. Oh, that's a easy wish to grant. Since I know how to sue, I spent my whole set. Oh, you made them. You made them yourself. Oh, that's so. That's so nice. You know, that's that. That makes a present like ten times more worth it. Like, yeah, obviously, especially from the ones you love. Had made to um, not toys, but gifts. Great toys would also work, but. I love it. Hawk knows you, you've lost and won a bunch won a bunch of uh, 100x battles. Oh, you won more. Oh, two. All right. So, uh, by the way, I, I'm still not sure how the 100x or 200x um, thing works. Like, um, does they really do they really count as like 100 matches? Is that is that a thing? Like, how does it work? What does 100x or 300x or 10x really mean? Because it's so demotivating if you if you lose like a 300x in, at start at the start of a split fest because you'll never get to um, to beat the, to beat the deficit again. Oh, and 100 points and how much is a normal win worth, Poivin? Oh wait, wait, we're playing the. Um, Oh man, I'm, I'm playing dumb. 
Yes, it does? Alright, but that's, that's just... So it's li literally 100 times more worth. That's so demotivating when you lose, man. Like... <laughs> Alright. Depends on your score. Alright, let's uh, let me do something here. I'm not playing paying attention at all. The gun dragon. Oh yeah, he was I I should have known that. I should have known. There were there was like a um, Killer will coming from it, and there was nobody to be seen there. Nice. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw a booyah. Oh, that was a bit too early. The pink ink is so pretty, oh, so pretty. my least favorite map to be honest all right dragon go to the thingy get it get it get it yes we're so good I think it's the least favorite map of a lot of people. Yeah, I'm not sure why, but I don't know. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> the Kraken. <laughs> did, we, did we do good? Yes! We did it! The uh, Booyah was not bad at all. I won a 333k battle for the chicks. Congratulations, Joseph. Hog knows you won a 333 last fest. I'm not sure. I, I think I've won one. <coughs> and I made a video out of it. I'm pretty sure I have a video on my channel called... Oh my god, I won a 333 match. With some cringe clickbaity title. Can you become a member? Why am I not, am I not seeing that? And there's still so much so much I should fix with this stupid stream overlay. You're back. Alright, Kiwi, now you can finally see the video that you haven't seen yet. Right? <laughs> You're back! Oh no. Um I got a booyah splash. Uh, thank you, Kiwi. Thank you for the support as always. I love it. Um I'm gonna open the tricolor a bit more. Finally, it's a fun video. I think it's the uh, the side order. <laughs> I still haven't beaten it, man. I, I'm I'm not playing it nearly enough. Oh well. I really like the side order DLC. I have so much fun with it when I play it. But can somebody play with me on Team Chicks? I I can sadly. <laughs> I, I, if, if I had, could, I would. Which team are you, Oivind? Oivind! Yeah, the, the, the ink is fine, it's cool. They, they have this little, um, like, sparkly pa paper parts in it. Like, the, the house called, the, the festive, um, I'm, not the, I'm not sure how it's called. You know, you've got those paper cannons and then boom, confetti, confetti kind of stuff. Is it called confetti? But look at the, the shapes. It's like, there's the Easter egg, some flowers. 
Play by me some flower. Gosh, that's such a good song. The Miley Cyrus song. I've never listened to it. And it's already stuck in my head. That's that that's that's when you have a good hook. Buy me some rain. Whoop. 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 Rup, rup, rup. But yeah, I like it what they do with the little with the ink. The Halloween had some fun fun things in it, I think. They had um Weren't they like lowing in the dark kind of figures in it, or at least in the practice room. Uh, yeah, I, I think I only did it with you and uh, Neptunia, Kiwi. <laughs> I don't know, it just feels so weird. Like, you guys are always here, and it just, just doesn't make any sense uh, not being able to watch those videos. You know, you're the most chappi chappiest chappies out there. So that's why it's so easy to share a video. Mm -hmm. Especially you two. You're always there. It's insane. It makes no sense to stick with this old fart. You've got a whole life ahead of you. Go on without me. Alright, Oivin. Let's beat some teenage inkling asses. Teenage inkling squid game colors. Old fart, but an entertainer and kind one. Oh, thank you. So, uh, my daughter was not happy with me shaving the hair. She was really mad again. I just did it a few an hour ago. That's so funny. She says you look like ten years younger, and I hate it. Like a normal adult would say the opposite. Like you look younger. It's, it looks good on you. But nope, she hates it that I look younger. Oh, what's going on? This is not normal, right? Why was you? I'm so confused. They were just standing still. The server's not broken though. I'm so confused. Did you guys see that? Oh, no, 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 shoot me! You idiots! You're crazy! There's a streamer rule! That was so weird. They, was, they were just... That, that's, maybe that's a tactic. Just stand there like there's a communication error. And the moment I also do nothing... You know, attack. Like some pro tactic moves. The communication error meta. Pretend that there's a communication error. Whee! Whee! By the way, are we fighting against our own team? I think so, right? Because this is not the Bear Cubs color. Those spheres are so fun. Uh, you rarely get any damage with it or kills, but still. Oh. Oh man, the, the bubble is so good. Yeah, I really have to go. Alright. Oh well, we don't we don't need a freaking I'm the only one allowed with range. Whoa. Actually getting hit there with the fizzy bomb. Ah! No! Team purple behind me. We're getting our ass beat, man. This is not looking good. Is 
This is not looking good. You hate Fry? I think she's got a lot of haters, and therefore I'm I'm in camp lovers. She reminds me of that kid in the classroom who always gets bullied. Which is sad. But I, I think she's so unaware of it, that's some somewhat charming. Like she's always happy. <clears throat> Oh yeah, um, sure. We'll we'll, uh, we'll make. Well, I will do a few with Oivin. Like let's say we don't we're not in a hurry, so I will do a couple of with with Oivin. Then I will do a few with you, and then we'll play a bunch to with, with all the three of us and any other bear cub that wants to join. Do 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 do. I'm a fry lover. She's a fun personality. Yeah, I, I think she's more... She's um, nicer. More nice than um, Shiver. But, you know, she, she, people just simp for Shiver. Because of her looks. Something that I would never do. With a Splatoon idol. That's just weird. It's weird. Oh. Let's go. All right, we are. Just, the, the other one was just a warm up. We now have the real colors, the bear cup colors. So let's win. It's a huge map, man. Like this iteration, I kind of like. But the other one is also always so claustrophobic. I have no idea where they're all coming from. Come on, can you guys stop it? Oh, I felt like there were like five different. Killer wheels there, but <laughs> what do you mean, Neptunia? I obviously like her because of her personality. I'm just too scared. Okay. I always pick Shiver for a reason. With I never pick um, teams because of the idol. And I also never did with Marina, by the way. That's something that I cannot do. I can only pick the team that I want to pick. For oh man. All right. Uh, where are they all coming from, man? I've got so much, so much trouble. Orientating here. Protected. All right, great. Ah! It's so dangerous, man. Ah! No, I, I just picked the one that, that I want to pick, like, purely on the subject matter. There's also always a good reason to go for a team, based on the option, based on your personal preferences. Ah, I'm playing like shit, man. Good lord. This is not looking good at all. We're getting owned. Woo! Let me switch over to the um, brush real quick. This was not um, not looking good. Skiddly do do do. Da -da 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 -da. 
like uh, I think this we, we all play Splatoon in this family or at least ish it's more that Simon my son plays it a whole lot he's already ruler five <laughs> so dumb so he's, he's the biggest Splatoon fan in our family um, but I picked bear cubs my daughter too we played a few matches this week uh, today and I think uh, Jamie and uh, Simon both went for the chickens. Cheeks! So we are rarely in the same team because every single one of us picks the team that we feel like picking. Not because we can play together. Or at least not anymore. No, I don't have any um, gravitation or, or I don't feel... Like, I have any special bond with any of the idols of Splatoon 3. I'm not sure why. It's not the same as with Pearl and Marina. I really like those idols. I don't mind them. I have noth nothing against them, too, but still. Oh. No, my son just, uh, he was holding a bunch of chicks, um, the animal types, in a in a uh, little animal shop, how, how you call it, uh, pet store, <laughs> animal shop. <laughs> Can I buy three animals, please? Oh, crap, I thought I had the... <sighs> Booyah. So he was completely in love with the little chicks uh, around Easter. <laughs> the animal types. <laughs> you have two vegetables and three animal types in the animal shop. So ever since you hold those little chicks, he's completely in love with them. All right. Other team. All right. Uh, I'm not. I'm not feeling it. I'm. Oh, God. Special spam is real. I'm so done with this closet thing. Nothing works in my favor. I can't even hold a controller without touching the keyboard. Let me do a double bomb. Ah, I got owned. Good lord. Here, please stop it with these freaking missiles. It's so annoying. Finally, I get a kill. Ah, killed by the same bomb. Sorry, Oyvind, couldn't protect you there. I was struggling big time. Doing some painting though. All right, near the end I did quite good. I, I think I painted some patches here and there. Yeah. Uh, oh. No. Like what? What did Team Green even do? Like they're completely off the map. Like they. <laughs> good lord. For real, I don't know why some of Shivers ink colors are so beautiful. Uh, people are also picking it because of the colors. Ah, yeah, that's not how my brain works. All 
All right, let's play three more, and then uh, I'll play uh, a couple of five with uh, Kiwi, with the try. And then we'll um, do a bunch with the three of us, shall we? Do you agree? And now we have even more story. Yeah, I still have to uh, get to the whole story part. I'm also not really up to date with the story overall past uh, this, the campaign. I haven't read one, uh, these transcripts and all that kind of stuff. Wait, can you team back on Bunny? I find it funny for no reason. Sometimes team back, we had a squid party. Squid party? Who are lovers? Shiver and... Um, fry? They're best friends. Arena and Pearl. Oh, yeah. I was imagining, yeah. Best friends for life. BFFs. Yeah, they, but they, they should keep it subtle, you know? So it's that, li that, that, that little secret. <laughs> All right, let's go. I'm gonna I'm gonna do my extra best now. Not that I wasn't earlier, but let me focus and let me get the freaking motion controls under control, man. I'm struggling so bad. He really was going after me, man. Yeah, I'm not, we're not playing against other teams for some reason. I'm pretty sure Team Bear is uh, in a minority. Because in this household, I am the only one who's not fighting against myself in the normal mode. Alright, please! Oh, good lord! Oh, god lord. Explosions, yeah. I... I... I don't squid party, also. I find it annoying. There's always a bunch who just want to play the game, even though you're fighting your own team. And I, I don't want to be that selfish guy, that guy, selfish kind of guy who ruins ruins it for those who want to play the game. So I never squid party unless it's a, a private battle. You know, you're, you are kind of ruining it for those who want to play the game, and it's against the rules. You're not allowed to squid party. You know, it's not that black and white. Sometimes it's fun, I guess. But it's also, you can only do this and that, that's it, you know? <laughs> Squid partying gets boring real fast, at least to me. Oh, what are you doing? I was, I was genuinely mixing up the colors. For a moment, I thought I was Team uh, Orange. Ow! Spirit Link! How you doing? No! Alright, uh, how many... One more with Oivind, I think? I, I, I might have been lost count, but... One more with Oivind, and then um, we're gonna do... A few with Kiwi. This mode. Doing good, tired, but good. Uh, that's that's like I can relate to that. <laughs> that's my my base state. 
Solid 7 out of 10. Tired though. I'm doing good. I was kind of sick um, this week-ish, but I feel like I'm on the better hand. So that's nice. Just chilling with the family and the dogs. No, it's all good, you know. Squid parties, I don't really mind. It's not really a problem too. Like sometimes when there's an uneven team, I really like it, you know. <clears throat> when there's like V4-3 and the thing hasn't restarted because it just happened after the little mark. Then I like it. You know, because no use fighting V V4 when everybody is completely a uh, very experienced General Kenobi. Well, I'm mentally tired due to my accents. Oh man, even reading that sentence gives gives me PTSD. Like I didn't even study. I I never went to university or or I didn't have a student life. You know. After my first degree in, in design and technology, I just went straight to um, <laughs> earning money. Money. Getting a job. But it's the idea of having to learn, read books, <laughs> like, it's depressing to me, man. I was so happy that I, when I was able to work. It just wasn't for me, man. Also, I'm not diagnosed with it, so I shouldn't just assume stuff, but I'm pretty sure I've got this dyslexia thing where it's just very hard for me to read books. So studying was always a hell. All right, I have to... Yes, it's an error on cable. Yes. Hair. All right. Oi, Vin. Be, be quick. Join me. But you know, uh, I guess it's not for everyone. Some some folks need to study. You know, you, you will make it a terrible doctor by just, um, you know, doing it based on your creativity and your passion. Like... <laughs> No, I, studying is overrated. I will go straight to um, s surgery on people. S you know, reading books is overrated. I'm a doctor, baby. <laughs> so I guess if you're not creative and you have a very, if you're not creative or talented with music or something like that. And you have dyslexia, that really sucks, man. I mean, it's just cutting someone open. That's not hard, to be honest. <laughs> I don't know. I've, I've, sometimes I've heard one of those gurus telling you how to be successful. And they, they'll, they'll just tell you that you have to learn it in the field. And that school is overrated. And I'm always like, you're just talking about this really small part of jobs. Like the creative jobs and the social jobs. But... <laughs> For so many occupations, it's that it doesn't really go well if you don't study. Like, <laughs> you'll make a terrible doctor if you don't study. And there are so many other jobs where you just, you know, it's not even an option. People will die if you don't study. Oh, not the miss house! Sorry, I, I failed you. I was having trouble with this one dude. Ah, who shot me? Reflux, a one shot with reflux. All right, GG's. Can I be, cannot even be mad at that. Alright, fire! Ah! Didn't see him. I 
Let me paint the base a bit, so we don't have to uh, worry about that later. Playing with viewers, yes, uh, I'm playing with the one viewer. And in a bit, with two. How are you doing, Salmon? I was live. Oh! <laughs> oh, that was so close. Oh! He shot me in the air and somehow I slowed down. You're doing good? Good to know. If you're a team backup, you can probably join. It's a uh, monkey brain pool. Um, monkey brain. No spaces. Not even sure if there are spaces allowed in the pool name, but... I'm going to get my special up and going for an aggressive. Ah! Oh! I'm totally not aware of the spawn point, man. Jeez. That was bad. Yeah, no, I, I just wasn't aware of a spawn point there. I'm dumb. I'm too fast, baby. <laughs> All right, uh, we're not. Uh, it's not going. Uh, I'm sorry, Oivin. I'm letting you down. I'm going to restart. Uh, I'm playing a few try with Kiwi, and then um, I'm going to fully redeem myself in the open with friends. Skiddly doo -doo -doo -doo. You got two 100x battles earlier. Nice. Yeah, but we are doing open in a bit, Salmon. Uh, I'm just going to play with uh, Kiwi. So try. Like four ish. And then we'll do open battles with viewers. At least Kiwi or even. And maybe you, if you're team backup. Stoop. Bomb. Team Baby Chicks. All right, Kiwi. Prepare for battle. You're doing good, Salmon. Good to hear. <coughs> da, 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 da. The music is so funny. Well, it reminds me of the Muppets. Look at how happy they are. Can I at least get like 10% of, of, of their energy? Let's defend the shit out of the sprinkler. All right, let me. Uh, um, number one base painter. I'm so bad. So bad. Oh, we all died? Crap. Ah. Oh, he's splashed up prone. Nice. <laughs> 
No! Ah, oh, what my hit? Stole my kill. Ah, man. Not the errors. Are you on cable? That's probably the most likely the reason. Anybody's on Wi Fi? It's just my switch not wanting to connect to other switches. No, come on. All right. Right, I need to do better with the killing, man. She can't win. That you you should go and see a therapist, Yosuk. You know that there's probably a correlation with your obsession with the how's it called again? Typewriter. Your hate against Fry. It's not healthy. It's all about balance. It's just my switch not wanting to connect to other switches. Ah, uh, what do you mean? Like literally your device having trouble with other switches? No, it's your internet. It's always the internet, like the, the Nintendo or Splatoon itself is somewhat stable. Nine out of ten times, it's it's really Wi-Fi. Unless you tell me you're on cable, you will not convince me otherwise. Like I've got multiple switches in this household, and the only one with Wi-Fi errors, with communication errors, is the one um, that's on Wi-Fi. <laughs> I guess it's time to switch it up. Wink, wink. Uh, it's all, it can also be complicated because there's also a device called the Switch which can, like, um, split multiple internet cables. So it's very confusing when you're talking about your internet situation. Like, I connected my Switch to my Switch and my Switch is having problems with my Switch. Like, so hard. Nice. All right, uh, let me do something smart. Smart plays. Ah! No, Kiwi. <laughs> <laughs> it was my smart spot! Your light switch is also called a switch. Every time when I s flick the switch of my light, my switch internet switcher doesn't connect to my Nintendo Switch. See? It's confusing. I got a 
kill! Nobody sees me! Is this like the only spot where there are no people are spawning? Ah! <laughs> no, they are spawning! Ah! Oh god! No! Ah! Life's so unfair! Oh, that's the worst feeling, Salmon! My son had that too today. I think it was a 10x battle. Not as bad as a 100x, but still. No! Ah! Oh, one little bubble. Oh, yeah, that's exactly what my son had this weekend. It was really sad. He doesn't realize how good he is for his age, but he's so hard on himself, like... Ugh, all right, I painted like my life depended on it. My hand hurts. So hopefully it pays off. Yes! Not the winner winner, but at least team whatever is it is, Bunny didn't win. He's really hard on himself, kind of like his dad. <laughs> yeah, he maybe he's got it from me, probably. Give it a boot. You know the only reason I deal with it better is because I'm like five times his age. <laughs> Six times. Yo, you son! All right, let's do two more Kiwi. Then we'll 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 get some backup from the Great Oivind, and maybe Salmon. Unless you're having constant communication errors, because then we cannot play with you. But yeah, losing by dot one is like terrible. <laughs> Yeah, we did very good, Kiwi. Do, 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 do. Wow, you're good. Alrighty, 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 alrighty. Let's go. Let's go. Huh. Let me first paint base real quick. I got my special up. Right, amazing. No, 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 Can I just... Ow! There's a charger. I wasn't even aware of an enemy charger. Should have checked the weapons at the start. Whee! I got the freaking roller. Ah! I feel like we're getting our ass kicked. Hey! Jump! Anybody here I can lame? This is taking too long. No! No! <laughs> He was invincible! I'm so dumb! I'm so dumb! No, 
to kill the kiwi. Not kiwi. Any torpedo. There's just always something killing you when you get a kill. <laughs> ah, he's just running circles in this little stupid bubble. Got him. All right, we did pretty good near the end there, Kiwi. I feel so. I killed two and painted a lot. Ah, Team Pink is... Ah, it's a victory-ish. All right, let's do one more with the uh, S2, and then we'll uh, we'll we'll go with uh, with even. Yo, I can be pretty competitive sometimes for the, even with very casual games like this. I, you know, when you're getting older, it's easier to deal with that kind of stuff, but. When I was younger, I, I really always wanted to win. To be fair, I was also amazingly good at video games. Like, it doesn't sound believable, but with Quake 3 and Unreal Tournament and um, the early battlefields, I was always on the first or second spot. I was very good. Young uh, <laughs> reaction time of a young half-god, demigod. Uh, very competitive. But, you know, <laughs> later on, when you have to juggle with all, all different things in life you'll, you'll you just play games to relax that's like there's a different reason to play games now like when everything else becomes a competition too games become just fun uh, you just play it for fun at least that was that's how it worked for me I still lean towards competi uh, competitiveness. I like it when games are difficult. Yeah, yeah, not sh completely. Sh I don't agree fully because you know competitive games are not relaxing at all, but just so cool. Like so much ad adrenaline and probably dopamine gets released when you win your battle royale match. You know, to blow off some steam. Have a good time. Theater games are amazing, man. Ah! Bop, bop, bop. Bop, bop, bop. Whee! Oh, I should definitely make more kills, man. Ah! Oh, I thought I had the range. All right, all right, chap, jeez. We can do better. Gotta kill. All right, I'm gonna go for the uh, thingy. Right? I think so. So good. Worth it. All right, let me see. Uh... Oh! 
And the moment I don't look, there's obviously somebody. <clears throat> Whee! Got him! It was worth it. No, but we're losing all the ink now. Oh, it wasn't worth it at all. Ugh. All right, let's switch with uh, switch over to open with Oivin. The moment I died there, we lost all the ink. The only thing with games is that there are some games that I know I can pick up after one match, be already good at it again. If y'all want to hear, I got two stories about this. One about a card, and the other about a Mario Kart. Yeah, sure. Go ahead, man. I've got one similar. I know that Donnie was at one point in his life very competitive with Counter-Strike. Counter-Strike. I never played with it. Um... I never played Counter-Strike, but he did. But I was very good at other shooters. So he was, like, training for... for months. And I just joined f as a first-time player, and I already was as good as they were, probably slightly better. <laughs> like, <laughs> and he was so annoyed, not annoyed, but he was like, how are you so good at this game? But, uh, you know, when uh, he was just joining PC games at that time, you know, he was primarily a, a console player. And I was really in my prime. No, I'm not half as good as I was back then. Like, once you are good at specific types of games, like first-person shooters, it's very easy to pick up other games. A uh, room code. It's, uh, it's, um, it's monkey brain. Doop -doop -doop -doop. Are you joining, Salmon? Because then I will wait a second or two. Let me just have some fun with the uh, Splatter Shop Pro. It's a full team of Shappies! I caught a mosquito. So disgusting. Ah, it's stuck in my hand. Oh! I hate mosquitoes, man. Always a trade. <clears throat> I'm gonna read it in a bit, Spirit Link. First, I'm gonna destroy them. Destroy the enemies. Oh no, you dumb! Great. I'm gonna go and throw it over there. Yes, I felt like that was the good choice to make. Yes, the range, I love it. Not sure how significant the uh, the buffs were for. Ow! For this weapon, but. Ah, 
I always love this, this pro. Such a good weapon for casuals. Easy to pick up. <laughs> the bombs are so much fun. Get to the high ground real quick. Huh. Alright, fire. No, 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 you stupid. Ultra stamp. Trizukas, awesome. But they're all dead too. Whee! That's such a good spot for a uh, beacon. Got him. Oh, this is amazing, chap. Right in front of the thing. <laughs> So I used to play Call of Duty with most, uh, mostly Black Ops 3 with my brother and two friends back in the days. Let me see. Did it win? Yes! By 1%! Yes! Or at least 0 0.1%. Amazing! Amazing! Um, of course, we decimated uh, by them. But a couple of years ago at the time, uh, friends of mine decided to party. After a while, we jumped on COD. Uh, Black Ops 3, a bit drunk and decided to one-on-one -on -one each other. End of story, I ended up 1v3-ing them. Still managed to finish it on a draw. That's cool. Uh, for the Mario Kart 1, I played a lot with the Wii, DS and 7. On uh, and Then my, my, my then girlfriend invited me over to her place. Uh, she said she was a pro because she played every day. I ended up beating her without a sweat. <laughs> Hopefully you felt proud beating your ex-girlfriend. <laughs> yeah, I had the same, t the same thing. My nephew of five was such a arrogant little prick. He challenged me to uh, Super Smash Brothers and I defeated him 10 times until he cried. I'm just better. I'm just better, all right? <laughs> no, I'm joking. I did, I did feel bad winning against my son. He really wanted to beat me and... I promised him not to hold back. <laughs> a smirk for the rest of your day. <laughs> yeah, video games are fun. No, competitive video games and winning is fun. I do like it when people are a good sport though. If people are completely a prick about winning or losing, or ruining the, you know, you're still playing with your bros, you know, you should still be a good sport. So if people are being a shithead about winning or losing, that kind of ruins it for me. Oh, no, he was just sitting there. Great. I don't, definitely not talking about trolling like it. I love a good troll, but... Whoop. Fist bangs! Give me them fist bangs! Oh man, I suck. That sucks. This song is so cool. Woo! 
Sorry. So annoying. I just like the song, alright? Come on! My aim is so bad! Please kill him! Thank you! Sorry, Oivin. That should have been my kill. I let you down! Somebody's still alive in our base, right? No. Yes! Yeah, with the other game that I play, almost the game that I main, you guys know, the Hunt Showdown game. Sometimes it's just, you're, you're asking yourself, why do I play this game? Because I'm at this point where I'm okay, pretty good-ish. You can get like uh, zero to six stars in that game. And I usually sit around four or five, so... But I'm not nearly as good to consistently dominate, so I will also have some off days. And sometimes when you're unlucky, you have like five off days in a row, and then you really feel like, why, why, why am I playing this game? I'm, I'm so annoyed. I don't feel like I'm improving. I already had a rough day on work. Why am I playing this game? You know, and the moment when you feel like uh, um, taking a little break, you have this big win with, with a BR type of game, and it will give you so much energy, so much triumph, and so much adrenaline. Then you also realize, yeah, that's also the reason why you play. You, the, the lows are low and the highs are even higher, so... Yeah, I like competitive games. <laughs> now, the moment when I first won a Battle Royale game, oh man, it was so cool. It's probably H1Z1 or... So cool. No, winning... Winning of, oh, you're basically the winner of 100 people or something like that, you know? It's so cool. All right, let me see. Oh, nice! Whoever killed the freaking Ultra Stab. <laughs> he tied it. <laughs> and alive himself! Alright, cool. Oh, yeah, there was somebody in behind us. Got killed, though. Ah! Again! A trade! Oh, it's a bomb, though.
Oh, man, Jesus. Sometimes I do enjoy winning without being good sport. I remember this prick in um, elementary school, I think, or maybe a bit later. He was such a douchebag, and he really thought he was the better player in Super Smash Brothers. But Danny and I were very competitive with the game, and also very good. So, he was such a prick, and then I completely just destroyed him. And that just felt amazing. And I wasn't a good sport after, uh, at all. Because of how unsporty he was earlier. I really rubbed it in, like, you loser! Alright, let's bring it back. Not sure. Enjoy this moment about my life, because I ain't talking about myself in a long time again. Jeez! Charlie having personal beef trauma. <laughs> no, yeah, it's, it's just satisfying when somebody's completely arrogant and acting like they're like this professional esport player. And, you know, there was just one thing that I was completely sure about, that nobody could beat me with Super Smash Brothers except for, you know, my friends, Donnie and, 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 and co. But no random classmate. You Come on, you're not better at Smash Brothers than I am. <laughs> Especially when I was 16. <laughs> like, shut up with your stupid face. Like beating the pricks is just is just very enjoyable. I'm I'm never like that. When I play with my friends, I always want to have a good time and I don't make a big deal about the losses and the wins, but in that case it was very satisfying to rub it in. He was so arrogant. Ugh. Also not the funny type of arrogance, you know, the trolley type. Because I can appreciate a good troll, like I said earlier. He was just a annoying prick. Alright, let's concentrate. Let's get some wins. I'm painting the base. Let me win the games. It's not the best paint weapon, to be honest. Alright. Um... How did he survive, man? He was like ducking below my shots there. Nice. Was that your bomb or Vin? Probably. You're on fire, Ivan. You maniac. Oh man, those twitchy little pricks. Another kill. Amazing! I'm so good! It's so much fun to, like, play side by side with Oivin with an aggressive weapon. Oh man! Frick behind me.
Got him. Oh, that's Spain. I'm going for the extra ink. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we did it. Yeah, I personally do love to do a sarcastic arrogance sometimes, but just for laughs. Yeah, but there's 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 like this this um, skill to it. Uh, it's um, you can do it in a good way. GTS. Oh man, uh, Oivin, that was so cool how we uh, tag team like together, danced around the enemies, getting the assists and the kills. <coughs> that was cool. No, I've got this friend of mine, uh, Wesley. I've I've mentioned him uh, many times. He can be pretty arrogant in a funny way too, and I always love it when he does it. So if the right person gives you the most annoying prick uh, comment, it can be extremely funny. But if the wrong person does it, it's just annoying. I'm not sure. Yeah, no, it's all about context and relation um, context, I guess. Like I know who he is, and therefore it's extra funny when he's like toxic. I, I love it when he's doing the toxic character but if you're genuinely a bad person <laughs> then you're just a bad person you know <laughs> no it's just fun in games i don't know like it's the, the thing that always bothers me is like you're acting like you're so good in, with in this game and you're not even at the one percent of the best players in the world we are all just casuals and you're acting like you're the best player in the world like come on unless you are i don't know Dude, the dude from Splatoon 3 or some other big boy player who's doing the tournaments, that then you are allowed to be a prick. But not when you are just a mere mortal like you and me. When I was younger, I, I played um, badminton. It's um, how's is that called badminton? Yeah, that's the same in English, right? At a pretty high level, or at least not, you know, on a casually high level. We were one of the best teams around our cities, Rotterdam. Oh, error! I was always very competitive. I always always wanted to win. Update. With friends, let me go. Which maps are we playing? <laughs> I need music here. So happy. Inkblot, Art Academy, and the Humback Pump Track. Humback Pump Track! All right. Not the mahi mahi. I have jokingly arrogant friends. I always play along and be like, ah, oh, don't be like that. But I like it secretly. Yeah, that's the thing, you know. A good troll when they've earned your respect, your respect the other way around. That's good. I think the best friends type of relationships are when you can be extremely toxic towards each other or say nasty stuff that otherwise would be extremely damaging to a relationship but in your specific relationship it, it's only funny because you know each other you know like that it's um, sometimes when like a third friend gets invited and he doesn't know the relationships, it can be very confusing. Like, Wesley, for example, can say very cruel things to me and I'm just laughing out loud and the other guy who just joined is like, do you think that's funny? <laughs> like, <laughs> we've got something similar here going on with Perry, for example, you know? Perry can say all sorts of stuff and now I'm just, you know, he just cracks me up. I can only imagine her stupid face saying the insult to me. Like, <laughs> it's just so funny. Well, it's a disconnect. Oh, whoop! 
Uh oh, my home went fully dark for a long time. No, your what? Your home went dark? Like electricity fallout or? Keep going. It was not in our team, right? No. Oh, your game. Oh yeah. Sometimes Platoon has this um, very long loading screens or very long black screens in between the matches. <laughs> At some point I was recording a video or I wanted to record a video and I started up the game and I was like looking at a loading screen for like two or three minutes. Those are the most true friendships if you ask me. I could bash out a friend of mine, he would bash me out. But you bet if he's in any kind of problem, I'll drop everything and help him. Yeah, that, that's the thing. Like, Donnie and I can also say the most stupid stuff to each other. Like, Donnie was going through some tough times the last couple of days. His father uh, had some uh, health problems. And I just gave him the most uns insensitive text. But I knew it would cheer him up. And he was just... You, <laughs> you thought it was so funny. Because I know his humor and he knows mine. His father's doing all right, by the way. Not sure if you guys if you if you guys follow him on Twitter, but his father had a heart attack, so it was quite some stressful moments for our downster. Oh, yeah, or Discord Spirit Link, whatever you have that has Donnie in it on it. I got destroyed. Better, 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 better. Whee! Yeah, I'm not sure. Donnie is not really on Discord, I feel like. His, his Discord is more for and also by his fans. I think he's rarely on his own Discord. He's just too busy making awesome videos. Ah! Such a fun game, man. Do you ever have? Do you ever have this? weird realization when you're playing this game and you're almost thinking out loud like man this game is so awesome not playing it like you've forgotten for like a few days you've forgotten how awesome it is no ah i was hoping for a uh, oh it's the killer wheel all right that was weird Okay, I'm, I'm switching over to the, with to the brush real quick. We've won! Alright, not because of me! G to the G! I didn't know Donnie had that going on. Yeah, yeah, he's um... And that's also his uh, nemesis. Um, he, 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 had, he's, he had some periods of worrying about health kind of stuff. So these things hit hard. Extra hard. Um, but yeah, his father is doing good. So that's, that's amazing. Not sure why we're talking about Donnie. Oh yeah, because, you know, 
all his friends were saying nice stuff and my my text on whatsapp was like uh such a dumb cruel joke <laughs> but he knew what i meant uh what am i doing yeah all right cool no i did nothing here i got four two and uh, uh i uh did nothing no kills. It's Oivind who did some great steps, and probably you with your... Yo, I thought you were doing the Brella, but... Aww. Kiwi's just laying around next to me like the cutest little puppy. Oh. All right, let's go. Let's go. Oh, you prick! <laughs> I would just wouldn't die, and I was too eager. I easily could have thrown a bomb there. Oh, that was dumb. That was dumb. Very dumb. All right, let's paint the base so we don't have to worry about that in a bit. Regular bombs are so good. Oh, Jesus! Oh, gosh, what a jump scare! There's still a little nuke and candy that hasn't been painted yet. Yes, now we're good. No, it's, it's all about that, that little 0 0.1%, you know? Of these stupid ultra stamp. Ah. That thing really makes you retreat to a whole different server. Oh, I did something near the end, but I don't think it's enough. I'm in their base ish, but. No, it's not enough. Ah, oh, but... Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's so annoying, man. Ah, oh, the... I was in a good flow, and then I had this ultra stand. Made me, made me have to go all back to our base, and then there was a random bomb or something. Completely broke my flow there. Oh, well. <laughs> yeah, me <laughs> behind me, roller. Oh well, oh well. Let's draw a heart to lower the blood pressure. It's all about love. It's all about love, baby. 
all about you and me. What a big step. Slap, 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 slap. Slap, 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 slap. Battle time. Oh no, the dogs are so cute this weekend. Um, like, our kiwi, the dog kiwi, is, um, he's been really a puppy puppy for the better and the worse. He's like um, uh, such a sweetheart, always happy, but he can also be very annoying. Like just this weekend alone, he destroyed another plushie of my daughter and she was so happy with, about the new plushie. He obviously destroyed it. Sometimes if you leave him alone for like a few seconds upstairs, he just starts to piss there. Just to, to, to troll us, because he already knows to go outside. Never pisses inside the house. Unless he goes upstairs, then he just suddenly wants to annoy us. He sometimes bites because of trying to defend food. Which is annoying. Uh, but he's also the cutest and this weekend for the first time ever oh yeah and he's also bullying panda because panda is such a old fart he's just two and a half but we, we, we see him as a very old dog because he's slow he's not there's not too much energy in him <laughs> he always sleeps But today, they were just very cute, sleeping together. Like, as, as true pals, two buddies. And that really warmed my heart, like, oh, So there's a chance you guys will get along. It's so cute. Man, stop it with the bombs! Gotti! Right, let's be a troll! Never works! Ah! <laughs> I'm so bad! Get the dude. You made a bad move there, my dude. Queenie. You made a very bad mood. Move. I'm on fire, baby! Your dog is a complete menace. <laughs> no, he's such a cutie. He always lays like a baby in my arms. He just falls in the sky. Looking at me with those big, big eyes. Yeah, we did very good here. To be honest. And uh, he was also very... Uh, uh, he showed some balls today because I was walking the dogs and there was like a small dog but very aggressive and he ran towards us and Panda just went immediately behind me like a like a shit scared <laughs> pussy like like a kiwi like initially he thought oh that's another dog how, how, how cool and he was like happy and all but then he noticed that the dog was barking in a very aggressive way and he suddenly turned into like he made himself bigger and he had this very low bark and he stood in front of us like he wanted to protect us like he was uh, he was trying to protect the herd which was cute because it was a very small dog like if if anything would have happened i would, would have just picked it up and break his neck now i wouldn't break dogs necks all right jesus 
But you know, you get the picture. It was a small dog. But he was just standing there like, ruff, 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 like <laughs> trying to protect us. <laughs> While Panda, the oldest dog, was behind me. Shit scared. <laughs> like, oh, Panda, such a sweetheart. Such a sweet dog. <laughs> to be honest, if 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 a dog attacks my dog in a very aggressive way, I I would be able to capable of doing that. Like I, I will go full defense mode. I would choke the hell out of that dog because that's the only thing what you can do. Like, if there's a big dog trying to kill your dog, the only thing you can do is take uh, the collar thingy or not the collar thing, but the. Uh, I was called the leash and choke the hell out of that dog not necessarily to kill it but to a black to give it a blackout you know so they release big dogs are scary man especially when, when they want to kill your smaller dog not a fan stay away from me I would never th I would do everything to protect my babies. My doggo babies. Ah. They kill dragon. Been dead anyway. Whoa. I'm really feeling it with the brush today, man. I'm Sonic, baby. Oh man, I didn't know there was somebody there. Paint the middle part! Then we've got this thing. Yes! Woo! Do -do -do -do. That's funny because for us it's the eldest who protects the youngest. Yeah, but that's he's, he's a little fierce, tiny little aggressive little puppy he also, he's also very protective of his food something that that panda never had so when he's got something to chew on and you want to take it from him he starts to growl even towards us he doesn't bite me but he sometimes bites uh, the kids when they want to take something from him so he's that's way more aggression or not aggression like passion let's call it passion <laughs> in little kiwi so that he, he also had this d defense mechanism when there was a dog approaching us he literally wants to do, wanted to defend our family, which was so cute. Small dogs can really hurt big dogs. I wouldn't underestimate them. Yeah, you know, that's that's a thing. But you know, those big terrier pit bull kind of dogs who have the big T-Rex skulls that once they close, they, they never open again. Those are scary dogs. Don't, don't let your dogs interact with those dogs. And, and don't say that because I want to talk shit against uh, those dogs. 
because um, you know it's it's all about how you train them. But they're still animals, and they still have this hierarchy. And and human beings have this weird tendency to let the duck, to let all the dogs sniff each other, and that's just wrong. We shouldn't do that. We sh we should train our dogs to try to ignore other dogs. There's never a dog trainer that uh, that tells you that it's good to let your dog interact with any stranger dogs. It's just bad bad practice. You don't want to anger a, a, a big dog with your small dog. Just stay away from it. Like, don't take the risk. It's not worth it, man. And if you really want to socialize your dog, just go to some small dog thingy. Meaning, there are a bunch of them. Or go to a friend's house. That's already familiar with you and your dog. People are weird, man. They really want to force your dog on the other dog. Like, you know, it's so cute. Let them sniff each other. No, stay away from me. Stay away from me and my dog. With your giant ass T-Rex. You're crazy. Got it. Bit too late, though. It's obviously not the same thing with small dogs. There's not a big harm in it. But it still can stress your dog out if you are constantly approaching other dogs. You're not you're not invisible, fool! You've got the power up! <laughs> There's a big giant ass arrow yeah, at the top of your head, floating above your head. Can I do some sneaky stuff, please? I did a blade thingy! Killed him! No! Oh, good lord! I want to kill with those bombs. Oh! oh no! I couldn't get him. No, that was dumb. I should have. Shouldn't have approached. No! Oh man, I'm, I'm dropping it. The last twenty seconds. Up, last 10 seconds. Yeah, I did something, alright? Did something. Our dog is always carrying a stick in their mouth. They won't even notice other dogs. That's a good thing, Kiwi. Let, let them just have their own little moment with you on your walk. That's really what all dog trainers will tell you. It's really a normal people made up thing that dogs constantly need to interact. Not necessary at all. You only make them stressful. Yeah, it's always my, my dog is friendly, but you know that's not that's, that's not the point. Kiwi is like the sweetest dog, but he's also capable of biting Enea, my daughter, because of she take because she takes the food away or something. You know, it's still an animal. It's still you still have to read your animal. There are boundaries, you know. Like it's like literally the most. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the moment I'm t the moment I'm saying I have to make a photo as she and put it on Discord. <laughs> like the moment I talk shit about him, he's showing me his balls. <laughs> he's, it looks so dumb. All right, let me put it in petting zone. It's uh, not suitable for um for work. How Jesus Discord, why do you have such a annoying UI? 
Uh, why can I just open a? <clears throat> All right, I have to uh, I have to uh, share it next. He's like on his back, <laughs> like <laughs> no shame at all. <clears throat> Who did we lose, by the way? Oyvind is here still. Kiwi, did you go away? <clears throat> Dragon also. You said rip. It was your connection down. I feel Kiwi is uh, didn't click continue because you were writing a big, big story. You got kicked out. Oh. <clears throat> Let's uh, restart it real quick. So we can do a few more. Let me get these. Oh. Oh, you were leaving, Kiwi. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I'm just talking like a... Oh! Like I'm in, um, in an episode of Oprah. be mad at that we gotta kill somehow Dehydrate emoji. Yes. You've earned it. Literally. You bought the emoji. No! Oh! oh, I desperately wanted to get the kill and somehow go away from the explosion. And I ended up with doing neither of those. We got another disconnect. That's, that's amazing. Still, did, we still did a pretty good job. Let's um, disconnect real quick, Oyvind, and uh, give Dragon a chance to join. Are we still... Did we still win? No! Ah, would have been so cool. The music. <laughs> In the end, little vibrato. All right, let's leave real quick, and then we'll do a couple of more. Five-ish. Stoop! And with friends. Oh yeah, I was sharing... I was about to share balls on Discord. The moment I was talking about him being cute and all, but also a menace. This is how he showed up. It's in Discord, petting zone. Again, it's not suitable for everyone. PG 16. 18, even. Dragon, are you still joining or is it me and Uivin? Oh, there you go.
This is the the cutest way to sleep for dogs, by the way, because um, it's a a way of them telling you that they feel safe because they are ex they are exposing their most vulnerable parts, their chest and the 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 place where their organs are most vulnerable. So, or at least that is what I've what I've read at some point. What's poppin', Leopoldo Plancarte? I'm doing good. Yeah, I'm exposing. I'm sh I'm displaying balls in Discord. How <laughs> are you doing, Leo? I was live. Which team did you join? Oh yeah, he was mistrusting him and you. But you know, there's no. I don't know. With dogs, it's just cute, you know. We aren't on the same team. No, Leo. What team did you pick? Probably Bunny, right? I think you strike me as a Bunny type of guy. Or gal. Let's not misgender. Didn't get him. How did we get a kill? There were two of those spawns there. Yeah, you overextended. Ah! I'm just hitting the triple strike for just a millisecond, man. Ah. So unforgiving. Let me do something crazy. It's a bomb! Another bomb! And a special! Got he! Oh man, the jump squiff for attacks. They always get me. Well, let's take it back, boys. What's that? Ah, Tana. What's your opinion on fist banks? Uh, they're pretty useless but fun. That's my opinion. They're kind of a distracting factor because you're you're forgetting about them quite easily because not, they're not that good. But they're fun. Useless, but fun. They look cute. Little firework. Ah! ah I'm not doing too bad, but... I don't think... Maybe we did. It's always so hard to tell. Yes! Give me this fist bump! Oi, man! Do it! Ah. They are literally ink firecrackers. Should I do this? Psst, boom. It's cute. It's, it's cute. I'm leveling up the catalog. Yeah, which is much needed because I'm still barely at 40. Not even. I still got a month after this one, right? Because... Yeah. 
probably have to do like a match each day. It's easy to level up one level a day. After, uh, before we end stream, we're gonna use a shitload of money on the uh, shell out machine and see what we get. Hey, Kibi. Hey, you poopy. Hey, you poopy. Yeah. <laughs> no, you, you can't cuddle. I'm playing games. Sorry. Have you heard of uh, Brawl Stars? Um, is that the Super Smash Brothers ripoff? No, this Brawlhalla, right? It reminds me of this Super Smash Brothers kind of game. But I don't think it's it, it is, right? Brawl Stars. No, I don't know what it is. What system is it? What kind of game is it? It's a trade. Ah. It's just a fun online game. In the browser or what system? Multi platform? Milk tea, that sounds disgusting. Ah! You freaking inks missiles exposed me. Mobile, oh yeah, no, I don't play mobile games. Like, I don't have too much time on my hands, so whenever I have time to play games, I'm definitely not playing on mobile. Like, I'm, all, I'm, I'm from the generation that truly thinks that mobile gaming is inferior to any other gaming. I'd like to have a controller. Something with accurate controls. I don't like full touch controls. Sometimes when there's no choice, you know, I played some Minecraft on my phone because I didn't have a Switch with me. But I, it's not ideal. It's not like I really like it. Oh, you prick. But I, you know, uh, mobile mobile games is a big industry. It's not like, uh, you shouldn't underestimate it. It's a big industry. Lots of people are playing it. There are tons of good games on it. Let's bring it back, boys. We can do it. Don't your kids wake up when you scream no? <laughs> Sometimes, maybe, but um, fun fact, um, no. Oh. And Nea really likes it for some weird ass reason. She she has nightmares and she's sometimes very afraid. And she loves it when I stream because it makes her feel like I'm close or nearby and that I'm around. So she, she has like positive, um, a positive reaction on my goofiness when I'm here because my daughter sleeps right like right b above me so she definitely hears me but she likes it it's in a for a weird ass reason it's it's comforting her <laughs> like, don't, don't ask me why man that was rough I thought my I was I felt like we were beating them but by the way, I have my own phone now. My phone is having some issues, man. Like, this, I like iPhone just because it's a good phone-ish. But I always have the same issue with iPhones is that at some point I cannot recharge them anymore. The recharge ports get um, dirt, dirty or damaged. 
always the same thing with Apple. Like, I'm, I think that since they switched over to UBC, UB, UBC, um, um, UBC. How's it called again? <laughs> I've got this blackout. Like, just the UB, UB, UBC, right? Yeah. That, that should fix it, because their cables are so weird. USB-C, yeah, all right, thank you, Spirit. <laughs> it's, it's, it sounded so weird, UBC, UBSC, yeah. UBS, USB. I think it, it's probably fixed, because they were forced to switch over to uh, USB-C. Well, the, micro the, the, the Apple Jacks were so dumb. Very weak. No! I got him. He got me too. Knowing somebody's away comforting, we won't feel alone. My sister's therapist told her if people are afraid of the dark. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, that, yeah that, that's why she loves it. Like, I, I asked her, like, is it bothering you? And she sleeps better because of it. My son doesn't matter. Doesn't mind it as well. And whoa! Ah, and Jamie is sleeping at the other side of the house, so I don't think she's having too much. She doesn't too mind it too much. I think the dogs are also sleeping through it, so it's all good. Ah. Crap, only one more hit away. And the better brusher. <laughs> yeah, she, she's avoiding me, Spirit. No! Oh, God, darn it. Killer will, super chump combo. You would have hate living with you. <laughs> You know, lucky for them, I only stream uh, two nights a week. And when I'm playing Hunt Showdown with my friends, I'm not as, like, energetic as I am now. Sometimes. Oh, God! Freaking dog! It's all good. Ah! Ship with Ultra Stamp! I truly hate that special! Why <laughs> <laughs> did I take a picture? I, I felt like I was getting caught. <laughs> like acting stupid. Like. <laughs> exposed! So I guess put your house far away from Charlie where well, we have Cheppy Island, Cheppy Bay. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I think so. Yeah, you. Uh, yeah, lots of weird noises. I sometimes think, you know, when I'm, when when it's summer, I put my door open, and they shoot. They they probably heard weird stuff from the stream. Things tend to get uh, loud, especially with the horror streams with Donnie and Mikey. Hydrate. Yeah, having you know, there's all there's also those bottles that have like um, those little meters on it, like the lines on it, which tell you um, which one to how much to drink in a day. You get the huge ones that are literally all the the intake you require, but those are huge. So you also have those those half bottles that are. Um, uh, that, that are half the amount that rec that you are required to drink. Probably good. I think I drink not enough, nearly not not closely enough that I should. I want a scientific reason why bottle water bottles uh, taste better at night than in the day. Yeah, that's a good one. I um, that's 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 true.
I have a suspicion though. I think it has to do with the amount of water that's allowed through the bottle instead of a glass or I don't know. It probably has to do with the with the shape. You can just Whoa Jesus. Oh, that was also a killer will. Hmm. One and a half liter a day. I'm throwing lots of coffee, but that's not too healthy. Ah! Ah! Go, oh, Jesus! Jump already! I don't have to super jump on on my shirt. Obviously, forgot about it. It's a squishy toy. Scared the crap out of me. No! Oh man, it's so unfortunate. It wasn't even meant for me. No, I drink way too much coffee at work. I like coffee, but it's not healthy. At least not the amounts that I'm drinking. All right, we yeah, we still can take it back. Oh, ah, God, wasn't ready for him. What type of coffee? Just black, just black. Uh, I've got this bean machine thing that can uh, convert beans into coffee, and I just like it black. Why should go black? You never go back. Man, I'm painting like a... I've been painting so much! That's a great slogan. Yeah, I don't think it's meant for coffee, though, but... <laughs> uh, Jesus. Uh, that was hard work. Didn't pay out, though. No, I drink at least three in the morning. A couple in the midday and a couple in the evening, so two, four, six. It's six to eight coffee a day. Could be worse, but it's also quite a lot. But it, it was like the, the reason that I decided to drink so much coffee is that it was free at the at the the job that that i was at that paid me like shit amount of money it's like one of those intern uh um constructions so you have to work very hard but you only get like 200 dollars a month or not even sometimes it's even free oh you want to join i can restart one more time to do two more uh, matches, uh, Dragon. I thought you left because you wanted to leave. Oh, I don't like swearing too much because of, you know, the audience, but shit is, uh, I don't know, not too bad. I, I try not to do any F-bombs, but, you know, sometimes when we are doing the horror streams with Donnie and Mikey, I just get scared to, like... <laughs> Some, sometimes it slips. It slips. Oh!
But yeah, the, where I was working and they weren't paying me anything and um, The coffee uh, and you had to pay money for like sodas and any other drinks but the coffee was free for some reason! Oh god! Ah oh, man! You've seen your little company shorts? Yeah, those were fun, man. Oh, I had so much fun with the little company. Wait for you, how are you doing, man? How's life? You weren't here earlier, right? How's your weekend? You know, they are pretty good, but they have snipers and they cannot really paint. So, it shouldn't be too hard to win. Well thrown bomb! Not a well thrown bomb! <laughs> oh, that was dumb. I should have rolled a bit. Gaddy, I love it how you can condition your enemies with um, whoa, with a well-thrown bomb, so you know they have to go a certain way, and then you can just go there and brush their face off. It's a bomb! Special, not a bomb! Ah! Man, how didn't I get him? No! Again, I'm just not getting the, the kills here. Please die? Oh, good lord, this is so annoying! What? Please, no! Oh! How? Wasn't he dying? I hit him so many times! Like eight times? Pretty close! Dragon, do you want to join? Then I will leave. Let me know. I'm playing a few more. I'm playing three more. Ish. Let me know if you want to join. You don't want to join? Then I'll just I will stay in the same room. Okay, we'll we'll keep in the same lobby. You can uh, just stay here, Levin. Thank you for the games. No problem, no problem, my dude. Thank you for the games. Oh, my chat got drowned, but the Lethal Company got an update. Ah! Are we? Yeah. You know, no, we, we are going to play some more. They didn't really do too good view-wise for some reason. Well, that's, that's what happens when I'm not streaming Splatoon, I think. It's not like the Splatoon streams are doing wonders, but, you know, streaming for three people sometimes is somewhat demotivating, even though the three guys are amazing. But I, I would have thought it was, um, it, it would do a bit better. You know, it's, it, it has Donny, Mikey, it's got some scares. Three new entities, one new moon, and two secret moons. Ah! There's also a different game, it's like a content warning or something from the same creator. It's also a pretty fun game to play. Let's do three more games. And then a mending stream. Got 
Oh man, my bomb gets completely eaten by. Oh god! So chaotic! Good lord! Trick Shark, how are you doing? Are you playing Splatoon? Have you joined a team? Splatfest? Got him! Really feeling it with the brush today, man. It's just so satisfying to get a kill with it. No! Wasn't ready for company there. Don't get to play smart games with me. Jump! I'm not tr truly aware with special cancers, to be honest. Which one do you refer to? Like, they're not, they don't bother me enough. That was a nice bomb. a win right like anything ah uh, no I don't I don't really don't really mind you got room for a bear player uh, yes we'll leave and do two more trick it's monkey brain join the join the pool monkey brain we're gonna play two more before I end stream make sure to ready up there's a nice little box event I did was I was on fire this round I'm curious about my kills Oh, 10-0. Uh, it's not, like, amazing, but the zero kills is cool. So I'm gonna leave one time. Oivin, please leave two if you want to play. And then we're gonna play two more. All right? Create a room. Uh, Van Gogh's painting are the only ones that I'm actually drawn to rather than looking for a moment and going now what his are evocated uh, feels like they are depth and movement. Yes, his work is amazing. I'm not really into art to begin with um, Especially not modern art, but I went to the Van Gogh exposition in the Netherlands and I was so impressed by his distinct with uh, distinctive art style his he was such a rebel, you know? He did nothing by the book. Hold up, I'm gonna do something. What do you mean, Leo? I can start the game, right? You are not Team Bear, right? You are Chicken. No, but a Rabbit, Rabbit. I'm just gonna play... Trick Shark is here. I'm gonna play two more games. Or three. Two or three. Probably two if we end with a win. Let's do a maximum of three and try to end with a win and a minimum of two if we get a win, all right? Yeah, Van Gogh is, is uh, Van Gogh, as we say in the Netherlands. He's such an interesting artist. He's, a very, he's such a rebellious artist. Nothing is conventional, conventional what he did. Yeah, people all, all also only started to appreciate it f way later. It worked! I'm in the Discord! Great, Leo! We need the peoples in the Discord. Sometimes it's a snooze fest. No, that's not true. I am never bothered by the 
the chill vibes in our Discord. Even though we are sometimes quiet, I always know that we are lurking and just chilling. And I like it that way. Instead of, uh, you know, being spammy for the sake of being spammy. Whoop! Lasers! You never get enough lasers! Need them lasers! Ah, all right, Ivan. I was trying to help you there. I didn't have the range. Ah! <laughs> Couldn't even jump there. Oh man! Oh yeah, the roller. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Since we are talking about Van Gogh, do you guys know Han van Meegeren? No, 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 no. I probably should know him because he's a Dutchie, but no. No, 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 you're not going here. You're not going here. Ah! Ah! Oh, you don't get to kill Oivin that easily. Not on his watch. Got he. Got your back. Oh, it's Frankie. Is it our Frankie? By the way, I think so, right? That's our Salmon Run Frankie, right? The one I just killed? How do you like your popcorn? <laughs> I love your question. Um, I, I kind of like um, the sweet and salt variants the mixed ones it's a wipeout yes I'm pretty sure it's uh, Frankie yeah I rarely recognize people but you know I ah, recognize our salmon run Frankie obviously Right, he's just going. I'm going to paint everything he paints. And I'll, I will undo his work. So basically, Han van Meegeren is a, you guessed it, Dutch painter who got a lot of critic for not being good and other reasons. So because he was furious at the critics and how their incompetence, he began to paint and made them look like old paintings from famous artists from the Golden Age. And the critics actually believed those were paintings from, oh, I love it. I love it. Hey, Frankie, yeah, it is you. <laughs> I just said, like, I recognize Frankie. GG. Nice to see you in game, man. I rarely recognize names because I don't pay attention, but there was something with your clan tag and your name, obviously. Do, 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 do. I'm Teen Little Bunnies. You can never go wrong with a bunny. I like that spirit link. I know there was like this other dude, like, um,. It was this experiment, like, people like to shit on McDonald's because it's fast food and stuff. But some stuff they make is just extremely delicious. Like their sauce, their Big Mac sauce, and um, the quality of their burgers. Even though they are, like, um, uh, made as fast as possible and they, it needs to be, like, in many quantities. So it's pr not a premium thing. But he said, like, people, it's, it's way better than people give it credit to. So this dude went to this premium cooking event and he just chopped, uh, uh, he chopped the, the Big Mac in little parts and he made it different. So he took the same Big Mac with the same ingredients, but he made a little block of it with a little wooden stick in it so you can eat it like a small part. And all those food ex experts said, oh, this is incredible and this is so special. Like, <laughs> it was just a Big Mac, you moron. Like, see? Like, I'm not, like, a big fan of McDonald's. I think they're way too expensive for, you know, crappy food. But 
the sauces, um, the Big Mac sauce, for example, is just very good. People should also give the credit. So he just made a Big Mac into like some premium food just by re yeah, redesigning it, you know, making it smaller in a little in a little block. <laughs> I love it. And uh, I think the same dude did something similar with art. Um, he bought like those little paintings from um, Ikea, the Swedish company, you know? Uh, wait, I'm telling a story! Um, and he, he uh, put the uh, little paintings in this little, uh, in this very fancy art exhibition. And all those art experts were looking at it like, hmm, nice brush. Oh, amazing detail. Like, <laughs> you idiots. It's from Ikea. <laughs> Like, oh, human beings, they are so, they're so... They're so dumb the moment they think they're experts. Like... <laughs> oh, I like it when they get exposed like that. This fancy VIP kind of people. So much fun. Ah! But in a way, that's art too, you know? Art should be a discussion thing. It should be uproaring. It should be rebellious. So, in a way, it's like art. The moment you want to disprove art, you're actually being an artist. <laughs> Which is ironic, you know? Ah! Is that Oivid? I thought he was in my team! Orvid, help me out! There's a clone of you! Right in front of us! No! Ah! I hate it when Oivin does his Oivin thing! And he's not even named Oivin! Whee! Ah, oh, alright, stupid jump. Honestly, most of these experts are el elitists for nothing. Yeah, that's the thing. You're like, just being fancy for the sake of being fancy, but... And the moment you tell them that you like a hamburger from time to time, they will laugh at you. And once you cut it up in a little bo block, then it's, it's suddenly... Fancy food. Did you know you can use L trigger to throw fist bags? I always press A, to be honest. So I, sh I should um, take that into consideration. Ah! All right, let's, let's play a few more. I want to end with a win. So let's play until we get a win, all right? Shouldn't be too hard. We did pretty good. I'm going to focus a bit more. Uh, let's get a win. Casually exposing your dog's balls. I'm pretty sure Kiwi did not, did not consent. <laughs> <laughs> Dog balls are funny, don't you think? Charlie having a casual, let's end on a win, Trava. Yeah, you know, if we, need to, we need to end with a win. That's just a rule, all right? That makes you laugh, yeah. <laughs> I remember that. <laughs> I remember having it. This stupid immature laugh with a friend could have been Donnie at least somebody with similar type of humor as Donnie or Donnie we saw this chihuahua with the biggest dick ever <laughs> and I just did I was sitting there on the little and I, I just said whoa <laughs> and then he looked too and it was humongous it didn't make any sense and we just couldn't stop laughing it's so dumb it's so childish, but it was so... The dog was as big as this, and his private parts were twice his size. <laughs> and he was just proudly walking like such a small dog. It was so dumb. He couldn't stop laughing because of a dog's penis. Yeah, it's very immature, but... <laughs> Oh no! no! 
Sometimes life's just funny, you know. Don't take it too serious. Oh god. Unless you are a doctor or a surgeon, then you should take life very serious. Oh god. Ooh. See? You get it, apparently. <laughs> ah! No! 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 That's karma for talking shit topics. Oh, I see. You can throw the fizzies like that. Alright. Good to know. Thank you, Leo. Oh man, if I uh, spammed it a little bit more, I could have had to. Alright, alright. Step it up, chap. Step it up! Nope. I'm gonna paint some to the left, right? I mean, rather. Okay, go, 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 go. No, why was that a trade, man? Ah! doesn't matter if you are 10 or 50 you'll still laugh at that yeah I think maybe that's a guy thing I'm not sure but like um I'm even laughing at this <laughs> you've got you are a chihuahua owner so you know their 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 funny little attitudes you can just you can just imagine it looking at like this uh Oh, that would be that would be cool in uh, about with it if you could throw it. All right, we need to play one more. Good lord. Chihuahua's a funny man. Uh, I wanted to say something. Yeah, like um, I I was I, I was always watching this um comedian in the Netherlands who was very childish in a way and I always thought like I will outgrow him in a way <laughs> but recently I've been watching like a DVD and he still cracks me up big time the same goes for um, I was watching this uh, YouTube little documentary about terrible sequels and this this one was about uh, the son of the mask and Ace Ventura jr. like both um, Jim Carrey sequels but in the most terrible way without the man himself just a a, a producer studio kind of idea um, so I rewatched some favorite scenes of mine of Ace Ventura with Jim Carrey like the most childish scenes possible and it still cracks me up the same as it did when I was 16 like <laughs> good lord so funny A nice bomb, a nice little oven bomb for you. Oh, nice! Whoever threw the triple strike, probably oven. I'm gonna help you out, Alex.
Your relatives are coming over. When? Now? Say hi to them from me. Hi, Leo relatives. Cousins. All right. A bomb! Special bomb! No! Not the freaking Ultra! There's one sniper trying to get my ass desperately. I'm not going to survive that. Nope. Stupid killer whale. I knew it. I knew it. Shouldn't have jumped. <laughs> Kiwi needs to go outside. Survive! I'm hitting the shield. It's a my part! Perfect ending of a perfect stream! If I try some myself. Gosh, I like the uh I like the ink brush. Oh I was doing so good! Casually good, alright? I'm not getting cocky here. I'm no blade. But I did do well. Overall split hey! Pro Gamer Charlie has awakened. See? You speak my language. It's just a 6 1. It really felt like a 60 1, though. But, you know, not dying and getting kills and painting a lot is all what matters in, in, in turf. All right, all right, all right. Um. I'm gonna use. I'm gonna. I'm gonna do a bunch of these uh, shellout machines. So uh, let's see what kind of stuff we can get. Ten of uh, ten shells. Swim card. A purple. Three of those never hurts. Common elder. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, another of those cards. A useless card. Another of the useless one. Um, I should probably not spam too much. Ship shape cargo co splash mop model. Jesus, it's a mouthful. Per play. Fair enough. Red one. Bring it. Table turf cards. Uh, another red one. A magic. I think I need another of... I still need one of those golden ones. Pretty sure. Yeah, last game was nice. I don't care about the money. Wait. You have so much money. Yeah, I never spend it. Let's not spend it all. If you play the game somewhat much and you have all the stuff you want. I don't know. It's easy to earn money. Stickers. See? Or even as... The maximum amount. 
Dip it, dip it, dip. Dip it, dip it, dip. Lots of stickers. Red. Oh, a nice banner. Orphan beating Elon Musk. Infinite monies. Can you buy back Twitter? Wave it. Yes! I like happy sounds. Alright, we dropped beneath the nine. Ten, ten, hundred thousand. How much? Ten thousand, hundred thousand mark. Let's do a few more. Dibby dee, dibby dib. I want the golden ones. I'm just skipping because I want to see the golden ones. Can't wait for the day I'll get a golden banner. I think there are multiple, right? Because I've, I've got a bunch. I'm, I'm gonna... GG, thank you for the games. Thank you for the games, Dragon. See you later. I'm gonna check which, which I already have because I kind of forgot about it. That's, that's the thing. The moment you get it, you, you forget about it because... It's not as, not as exclusive anymore. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't care. We'll, we'll, I will get some money in the future again. It's like... Who needs in-game money anyway? I've got a bunch. Don't flex on me like that. Sorry, Neptunia. <laughs> no, but I'm, I was confused because I thought there was only one. Thank you for the stream. No problem, Trick. Make sure to subscribe and maybe join the Discord and uh, I will be streaming next Thursday and Sunday again. Sunday will be Splatoon, Thursday will be something else. Uh, currently we are playing Elden Ring. We still have a nasty castle to beat. You gonna go? Alright man, see you around. Leo. I think every season has a new one. Oh, that's, uh, is that so? Yeah, I don't keep, keep up and my, man. Bye bye, Chappish. Bye bye, Leo. Thank you for joining. I really appreciate it. I love seeing more and new and also familiar faces lately. The streams have been fun. They always have been, but especially in the last couple of streams. So much interaction in chat, even though we're just with like 10 ish people. It's so lively. It's so cozy. Oh, that was a nice banner, by the way. Let me check the banners and the cards real quick. All right, let's stop it over here. Not nothing too fancy. Let's check the the. We're clearly getting boring to you. You can say it. No, no, no. It is not true. Never. To be honest, I I since I, it, it, this is gonna sound so. Uh, demotivating, but I don't mean it that way. Since I kind of gave up on YouTube, at least like I put some more effort in my real job and I made peace with the idea that this thing just needs to be fun and I don't have any extra goals because I can only make one thing successful and I'd rather put time and effort in my real business than YouTube-ish. YouTube became way more fun to me. Like I have way more fun with you and the channel since I somewhat, you know, took a few steps back in terms of uh, unrealistic ambitions. And I'm very glad that this thing is just a creative side hustle to me instead of um, my job. Because I, I think it's a pretty hard job to stay at least, to, to have fun with it, at least, you know. Work is not necessarily a fun thing, so... If you have YouTube as your job, you probably have one of the best jobs. I get it, but still, it's probably a, such a such a hard grind. Uh, okay, uh, I wanted to do one thing, and that's check out. I think I don't like this banner at all. 
I, I just... I haven't found the banner that I f fell in love with, to be honest. Like, this one's kind of cool. Like, it, it has good contrast. These are way too Hawaii from my, from my taste. This one is kind of cool. Not sure where it comes from, but it's colorful. Lots of... Somehow we've got, like, four different plasters. <laughs> Reskin it, ship it. Like, these all look the same to me. These are cool-ish because the letters are so black. Good contrast. I'm a sucker for good contrast, you know? I don't like it when it's like... Like this. Like, these are just two vague colors. These are the golden banners, right? So I feel like these are pretty rare. But I'm not sure how many there are. And they can never go wrong with the table turf, you know? I'm gonna go with the table turf. To show off that I'm... This one's also cool. I don't know. It's so hard. There are also, there are also still a bunch of QR codes. You know, Q, table turf is amazing. I'm probably not. I'm, I kind of like self-proclaimed power egg. Like it's nothing t to be completely proud of, and I still I'm the self-proclaimed power egg. I have a hard time changing stuff. Uh, the same goes for... Um, um, oh, is it up to date, Kiwi? I have to check. The same goes for my locker. I can never change it. Why, why don't you open up? Oh. Like, this is the way it has been since month one. And I can just not, not change it. Like, it's, it's just too perfect. I can't, I can't change it. Like, I've, I see all my, all my family members and you guys have the most insane locker. But I can, can't change it. I will never change it. This is gonna be my locker forever. <laughs> it's so dumb and empty. At some point it got larger though. Not sure why, but... <laughs> I only spend an hour and I drop those things and I thought, oh, this is funny. I never touched it again and I'm just too used to it. Uh, trick shark. Here you go. Trick shark. Look at that. Like, I'm, I, I, I see how cool this is, but I, can, I just can't change it. My brain won't let me. Like, this is still a sh small one, though. I want to change it. Maybe I should change it to a sw No, the big one is fun. Like, the, a very big locker, but then with nothing in it is extra funny. Aptidia, let's see. Oh, it's so cute. All the little photos. This reminds me of a real life. Real life. I'm sharing proudly my Brella obsession on the door. Where's yours, Kiwi? Always annoying that I cannot find my friends. Oh well, we'll see it one day. All right. Yeah, yeah. I'm I'm ending stream. Obviously, it has been a fun stream. I had such a good time. I hope you guys had a good time too. Thank you for the games. Thank you for the games. Oivid, Kiwi, uh, Dragon. And I, what's the new guys called? Trick, trick, not trick shot. Trick shark. Trick shark. Kiwi's not here. Yes, Kiwi's gone, but maybe some somehow end up at the last minutes of the uh, of the stream. Spirit Link, thank you for the laughs. See you guys around, all right? See you next Thursday. Have a good week ahead. Whatever you're doing, good luck. Stay safe, all right? Bye-bye. <laughs>